cries out to you. We cry out. We cry out to you. To the left, then he goes to the left. If he goes to the right, then he goes to the dance. Dance, 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 everybody. If he goes to the left, then he goes to the left. If he goes to the right, then he goes to the dance. Dance, 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 dance. matter, oh Lord God. Kung may snow man, oh Lord God. Kung may rain man, Panginoon, wala makahadlang sa pagpuri namin sa inyo, God. Lord, this afternoon, oh Lord God, it is between you and us, oh Lord God. We worship you, Lord, because you are King. You are Lord of Lord. You are everything. You are Jehovah. You are beautiful Savior, oh God. We worship you. We worship you.
Sun Church. I will sing forever. Jesus, I love you. Jesus, I love you. God deserve the highest praises. Can we give a clap offering to our God? Hallelujah! Hallelujah! Thank you, Jesus! We love you, Lord! We love you, Jesus! God, if your presence with us, oh Lord God, no one, oh Lord God, can distract us, oh Lord. Thank you, God, for this wonderful afternoon, oh God. Thank you, Lord, for you brought us here, oh Lord God. Thank you, oh Lord God, sa inyong pag-ingat, sa inyong pagsama, oh God. This hour, oh Lord God, hanggang matapos ang service, Lord God. Ikaw po ang papurihan at wala nang iba, Panginoon. More of you and nothing of us, oh Lord God. Lord, we thank you. Anoint our pastor, oh Lord God, Pastor John, as he speak, oh Lord God. Anoint, oh Lord God, the words, oh Lord Jesus, na marinig namin, oh God. And Lord, this we pray, oh God, to your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord and Savior, and everybody will say... Amen! this afternoon I, I can really feel the presence of God in our midst while worshiping God amen who among you who among you here uh, agreeing with me that when we are singing uh, praise and worship to God uh, you feel something different amen sino po sa inyo nandito na nakaranas ng um, greatness ng Lord amen amen and now this is uh, another way how to worship God Let's worship God in our giving. And uh, in the Bible, uh, there is a verse in, verses in the Bible talks about giving because God is a giving, giving God. Amen? Our God is a giver. Amen? Can you say to yourself, my God is a giver? Amen? In fact, our life was given by God to us. Wow, Amen? So he gave us life, and also he gave his life for us uh, to die on the cross. And now this is our turn. This is our chance to give also to God. In na maus po ako ang taas, hallelujah. I can really feel the presence of God. Ang taas, pero na, naabot natin, hallelujah, by the grace of God. Amen. So 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 17 You know, everything we are doing here is uh, based on the Bible. And we believe that this church is a Bible-believing church. At ito pong share ko sa inyo about giving in uh, 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 17 is a book in the Bible uh, where, where uh, written by, by Paul. Amen? And uh, remember, Paul is one of the persecutor of Christians before. So before, if you, you, if you confess that you are a believer of Jesus Christ, Paul will kill you. <laughs> Amen? Papatayin ka ni Paul. But praise God, after he encountered God, he experienced God, and then he became a blessing to other people. He wrote the book, a lot of books in the Bible. And it says here, so um, Paul was being uh, used by God in his time, during the time of Jesus Christ, when Jesus Christ came here on earth. At basahin ko po, ito yung uh, uh, sulat niya sa, kay Timothy. Ang sabi po niya dito, Command those who are rich in present world not to be arrogant. Amen? Ulitin ko po, Command those who are rich in this present world not to be arrogant. Praise God, we are here in a rich country. Amen? 
'di ba? Mayamang bansa ito. So, ang sabi ng reminder sa atin ni Paul, isama na natin ang sarili natin, hindi lang yung mga tao noon. Command those who are in Canada. Hallelujah. Uh, not to be arrogant. Why? Nor to put their hope in wealth. Amen. So, this verse is saying that we don't need to put our hope in our salaries the, in our earn, uh, in our earnings because in Canada there's a lot of job. Ang sabi nga nila, you can never become poor in Canada if you are ma, ma ano, masipag kasi ikaw ang susuko sa trabaho, tama? Ikaw ang susuko, yung katawan mo ang susuko. But uh, God is saying and reminding us that we don't need to put our hope in the richness of this world. Amen? But put their hope in, in God. Why? Because when we put our hope in material things, material things are, are uncertain. Sabi po ng Bible. But put their hope in God who richly provides us with everything for our No, not only needs. For everything. Uh, ano nga sis? Uh, NIB, please. NIB. Ang sabi po niya dito, God, who, re- who richly provide us with everything for our enjoyment. Amen. So God blessed us for our enjoyment. Wow. Amen. Hindi yung God will bless you. He will give you a lot of money, he, a, a, a good salary, uh, just for you to buy ano, a laksan after that, <laughs> no pain reliever. No, God wants to enjoy our blessings. Amen. Because He's the one provide do, provides those blessings. Uh, if you are not working, then your parents, the one who is providing for them, is what no, no no other than God. Amen? And that's for our enjoyment. Amen? What's the meaning of enjoyment there? Alam nyo, number one, um, one, I understand the, the real meaning of joy. Amen? Or enjoyment is not only when you are happy or you are having party party like this, like that. <laughs> no, uh, the real enjoyment is um, you can feel it in your heart, in your inner heart, that even if there is a problem around, pro, uh, there's a lot of problems around you, you still have joy in your heart. Amen. And one thing that you, uh, that makes you enjoy, for me, when every time I give my tithes and offering to God, I'm very happy. I don't know about you. Amen. If you, you feel that, that you are enjoying that every time you put drop your offering to God you will feel so satisfied and uh, there is an inner joy in your in yourself that you cannot uh, get that from other things amen that's the enjoyment God wants us to uh, do with our blessings and i will continue command them yan so next is command them to do good Amen. So when we are doing good, this is not a uh, uh, ano option, command. Ang sabi po. So when we give our thoughts and offering, we are doing good. When we are making our uh, neighbor happy, the church blessed, we are doing good. Amen. And to be generous and willing to share. Amen. Praise the Lord. We have Jesus Christ. He have taught us how to share, not only during tw- December 25. Ayan. Amen. Ano oh, ko? Na- meron na ba kayong ano, uh, uh, list ng mga mga regalo? <laughs> Amen. Praise the Lord. So we are not doing only sharing or giving every December 25, but God is commanding us because He blessed us and He want us to enjoy and to share. Amen. Come on, let's pray. I want to pray for every one of us here. Hallelujah. If you can raise up your envelope, at even to those people na nanonood po, 
and in their homes. Ayan. Hallelujah, Lord. Thank you, God, for this opportunity that we, without you, we can do nothing, Lord. Opportunity to know that everything that we have galing po sa inyo, Panginoon. And right now, we are here uh, because you commanded us, Lord God, not to put our trust in these material things, not to put our trust in our own strength, but to put our trust in you, Lord. Every time we drop our offering here and uh, our situation is saying, kulang, kulang, uh, it's not enough, but Lord, you are more than enough for us. You are the one who provides for our needs. So we will give this offering We are not, because we are not trusting in these material things, but we are trusting in you, God, that you will provide all our needs for our enjoyment and for us to share, to be a blessing to others. Bless this church, Lord God, so we can reach more souls for your kingdom. Hallelujah. Bless all the people who will give this afternoon. Lord, increase them. Lord, uh, increase their salaries. Bless them and double their salaries oh god put the desires in their hearts to level up in their finances let there be a cancellation of all debts in their lives oh god in jesus name and lord we are happy we have joined our hearts in giving you our tithes and offering we thank you lord we love you in jesus christ mighty name and everybody say amen and amen I would like to welcome our VIPs. Okay, my welcome, Ayan. Ayan is here. She's from Hamilton. And also, Carly. Welcome, Carly, from Hamilton. Wow. So our church is ano, multi, multi, ano, multi cities. Amen. Peel region, we have uh, uh, Brampton, Mississauga, and Hamilton. Toronto, of course. London is here. Amen. Praise God. And soon, London, we will open a church there. Praise God. But uh, Brother Darwin and Ati Jo is required to attend the church. <laughs> Amen. No, they will just be, they will also visit here, okay? So, praise God. Amen. Yung anak mo may pampam. Okay, may, uh, may I call on our kids and let's pray for them. Okay, kids ages 13 below. If your age is 14, you are not kid anymore, okay? Just 13 and below. We will pray for you. <laughs> Selena, are you 13? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought you're 14. Amen. Come on, let's call on the kids. And uh, extend your hands. I want to pray for them. You know, it is very important uh, to pray and to lay our hands to our kids. Why? Because uh, we don't know the influence of this world, especially, especially in their school. So we need them to be covered by our prayers. Okay, let's pray. Father, we are so thankful, oh God, because you are um, the God who always protects these kids because they are our blessings from you. That's why we, we want them, Lord, 
to be always in your presence. Lord, we ask also the blood of Jesus to cover them from head to foot so that no accident, no wiles of the enemy, no plans of the evil one, Lord, will prevail in their lives. But Lord, your purposes only will prevail. Lord, we 